Don't go. This is not in the picture, is it? Okay. All right, level check one, two, three, four, five, five, four, three, two, one. <clears throat> Tim Burton's The Night Before Christmas. Oh, one more time. Tim Burton's The Nightmare Before Christmas. Now, I don't know what to think about this movie. I can't think of many movies that I don't have a grade on, but I've brought in an expert. Now, did we like this movie or not? Yes. I mean, I don't know what, I don't know if I liked it or not. I'm not really sure. Did you like it? Yes. Why did you like it? Because it's funny. You thought it was funny? Did it scare you? No. Do you think it would scare younger children like kindergarten? Yes. You think it would scare little kids, real little ones? Yes. Why? Because. All right. So you think it's okay for first graders to go? Yeah. But not kindergartens? No. Okay. But you think it's all right for older people because they won't get scared, will they? No. But you really do think it was funny? Yeah. All right. What would you give it? An A, a B, a C, a D, or an F? A. You give it an A? That's a real good grade. All right. Sarah Carter has spoken. The Nightmare Before Christmas. Now we move on to Fatal Instinct. It's a spoof on all those suspense movies like uh, Basic Instinct, Fatal Attraction, and so many more. From the brain of Carl Reiner. All right. One more. That was pretty long. I'm going to try to do it a little tighter. Do you really did like it that much? you kidding? Okay. Tim Burton's The Nightmare Before Christmas. I can't give this one a grade because I'm not sure what I thought about it. It is very creative. It's a little bit like Phantom of the Opera, frankly. There's a lot of music in it, and uh, it's extremely interesting. It's something like you've never seen before, a kind of animation. I brought an expert here on film, Sarah Carter, my daughter. Sarah, now, did you like this movie or hate this movie? I liked it. You liked it. Did it scare you? No. So it's really not a scary movie, is it? No. Did you like all the singing? Because there was a lot of singing. Yeah. What was your favorite part? I don't know. You don't know, but would you recommend it to your friends or tell them to stay at home? Recommend it to our friends. All right. On a scale of A, B, C, D, or F, what grade would you give it? A. Okay. That's the famous movie reviewer, Sarah Carter, an expert on children's movies. Now we move on to a more adult film, Fatal Instinct, from the brain of Carl Reiner. It's a spoof on all those movies like Basic Instinct, Sleeping with the Enemy, Fatal Attraction. This is one of those silly ones starring Armand Asante and more. Here we go. Okay. That was pretty good for me. One more for good. Yeah, they're coming out. Here we go. Real fast. Here we go. The Nightmare Before Christmas from the mind of Tim Burton. It's an unusual film. has a lot of music in it. I was surprised by that. And very much uh, in theme of Phantom of the Opera. But it wasn't scary. I don't know what to think about it. So I brought an expert on children's movies, Sarah Carter, with me. Sarah, did you like the movie? Yes. Did you think it was scary? No. Do you think it was funny? Yes. All right. Did you like the singing and that kind of thing? Yes. Okay. On a scale of like A, B, C, D, or F, what grade would you give The Nightmare Before Christmas? A. You sure? Yeah. Okay. Would you recommend it to your friends? Yeah. Okay. Expert on child's movies, Sarah Carter. Now, back to something I understand. It's an adult movie called Fatal Instinct from Carl Reiner. It's a spoof on all those films like Basic Instinct, Fatal Attraction, Sleeping with the Enemy. Well, this one stars Armand Asante and a lot of other great actors.